we were upset with the, the way our season ended last year in the, in the quarterfinals. And, uh, you know, we met as a program, as a team, uh, you know, right after the season over, was over and, and, and try to identify what our weaknesses are. And I think the team, uh, you know, starting last April, really got down to business and, and really focused on some of the things that uh, we need to focus on. And, you know, a couple of those were our strength. We really felt that we had to hit the weight room harder, that we got beat sometimes. Uh, you know, strength-wise, we didn't think conditioning. Our th we thought our conditioning was good, but from a strength standpoint, uh, um, that was a big factor. And I think that rolls right over into our, our our defense and our rebounding. I thought we were good on our initial shot, our initial set defensively, but uh, just like when you're shooting the ball, you can be a great shooter. You got to put it in the basket. And on defense, you can be a great defensive team, but you got to rebound the ball and finish it off. So those were a couple areas that we paid uh, real close attention to uh, postseason, summer, and early on here. So I've been satisfied with where we're at right now, but we haven't played any games yet either. I think we have a, a bunch of players that can uh, do a variety of different things and uh, uh, you know just for a couple examples Victoria Reynolds who played uh, you know primarily the four for us last year has spent a great deal of t a time working on her perimeter skills so you'll see her playing a lot at the three um, you know Eva who uh, you know was our starting point guard for, uh, rookie of the year last year you'll see her at times off the ball so we spent a, a good part of the time in the offseason working with her off the ball as a scoring guard so those are a couple things our versatility I think our work ethic is something that's really standing out to me right now. Our team really brings uh, you know, the lunch pail each day and uh, punches the clock and goes to work. So it's something I've been really excited about. Hopefully that will continue. The biggest thing is the CAA conference. I mean, it is really uh, top to bottom this year. I think uh, this is my seventh season, probably one of the best. I, if you look at the top 10 players uh, in our conference, they're all graduate uh, uh, students, uh, redshirt seniors, seniors. So uh, one of the biggest obstacles is, is that experience uh, and that go-to player. Obviously, you mentioned losing uh, Bianca Boggs last year, who was our go-to player. Who's going to be that player to step up? Um, we have a lot of time to figure that out. We have a few candidates, I think, that can do that. Um, but that all comes with time and, and experience. And that might be something that we don't have right now, um, is that experience at end of game. But uh, I'm looking forward. That shouldn't hold us back. Uh, I think we have some capable players that can uh, carry that torch. You know, obviously our, our two seniors, Ashley Taylor and Victoria Reynolds and Harper Birdsong, who's actually a, um, you know, a redshirt junior, um, you know, they've been real good in terms of leadership. They know they've been through the, um, the league for three years and uh, um, they know what the expectations are of our program, what, what's acceptable, what's not. But a couple of our younger players, Eva Hodgson and uh, Sydney Wagner and Nyla Pollard, uh, have all done great jobs in regards to um, leadership roles and so forth. So um, we're not going to be short of leaders here at William Mary. You know, this team uh, is real hungry. Uh, again, I mentioned earlier that uh, finishing seventh last year in, uh, in, in the CAA conference, uh, you know, that could have really easily been flipped. We could have finished third, uh, uh, you know, in terms of our, us finishing uh, ball games out. And that's something that we, obviously, we talked about in the postseason and here early in the preseason. We've talked about that in order for us to climb that ladder, which is going to be a tough ladder to climb this year because of the strength of the league, um, it's going to be because of those close games we can, uh, we can execute in both offensively and defensively. And like I said, Eva last year, her playing um, you know, the point guard position as a freshman at any level, it's tough. Uh, but the CAA conference is just as tough. But I'm looking forward to her experience paying off this year. And uh, Victoria Reynolds, obviously, her experience uh, starting for basically the last two and a half years to pay off. Players make the stuff work. Here we go.